Welcome everybody to Bedbug Central TV. I'm your host, Jeff White, and today we're going to talk about an active ingredient that's commonly found in certain pesticides that people attempt to use to control bedbugs that most industry experts will say is not going to be effective against bedbugs. And that is the active ingredient, boric acid. Uh, there are a couple other names that it goes by, orthoboric acid, um, but the bottom line is if you see a pesticide that has the active ingredient or the primary active ingredient of boric acid, it is most likely not going to be effective against bed bugs. And let me explain why very briefly. Boric acid, and there are some things that even industry experts and entomologists across the country don't totally understand about how it works and how it kills insects. But the one thing that we are pretty sure of is that it needs to be ingested by the insect in order to work. Could it get through the cuticle and possibly have some effects? And could it probably or maybe kill some bed bugs in a population? It is possible, and I don't want to say definitively it will not, will not kill any bed bugs. That is not what I'm trying to say. All I want to say is that if you apply boric acid to in an attempt to control a bed bug population, it most likely is not going to work. And it's because we do understand that that active ingredient does need to be ingested by the insect. One reason why it works so well for other insects is because it is often incorporated into a bait. So say a cockroach is coming along and there's an insecticide applied that's in a bait form, which means that the cockroach comes through because it wants to feed on it, but that bait is laced with boric acid. And so the cockroach ingests that boric acid and that's why boric acid is very effective against cockroaches. There's also boric acid that comes in dust, um, and what that dust could possibly do is adhere to the exoskeleton of a cockroach. And the cockroach, believe it or not, is actually an insect that is very commonly cleaning itself, and in the process ingests the dust that's on their exoskeleton that has boric acid in it. So again, boric acid is an insecticide active ingredient that needs to be ingested by the insect to work most effectively. And because of this, it is commonly not very effective against bed bugs. So if you have a pest control company that you know is saying they're using an active ingredient that's boric acid based to control your bed bug infestation, you may want to look another direction for a pest control company. Um, and then if you go out to possibly apply something on your own, which is not something that we always recommend, but if you do make the decision that you need to apply something on your own, you might want to stay away from pesticides that contain boric acid because it probably will not be very effective in controlling your bed bug infestation. Okay, everybody, uh, jeff.white at bedbugcentral.com. Please email me any questions you have on today's topic. I'd be more than happy to answer them, and uh, I will see you soon enough.